I think the, the uh, United States is viewed as an empire um, simply because of its dominance around the world. Um, originally, its economic dominance. Um, and I think secondly, um, and more obviously, in this century as a, as a military power. Um, I think it has a, a role to play um, because of its size and because of its experience. But I think it shouldn't see itself as the dominant and only power, and certainly not as the policeman of the world. I don't think that's its role. Um, I think they do bring with them a, an experience of a democracy. They bring with them uh, an experience of an economy. Um, they bring a wealth of experience of social justice. Unfortunately, those are not the things that are manifested in the field. Um, the difficulty is that, firstly, they're seen as a military power. Secondly, they're seen now as uh, a global economic power that's trying to reclaim its place. And thirdly, I actually believe that they've lost their way when it comes to looking at social justice. Um, and I think that's being led and being pushed out personally by what it views as its military um, necessity to dominate the world stage. And secondly, um, as probably one of the power brokers in uh, international commerce and uh, economy. And I think it should realize that there are other players on the field right now. And they is coming up. China's already up. Um, and, you know, that big place that they had is no longer there. I think the realization, the realization of that, and certainly um, its its economic power, is something that it has to view, not just as something that it maintains its strength with, but something that it has to be able to share with the rest of the world.